We would still need to be able to build the same number or zone to allow the construction right. of the same number of housing units. This is just a different configuration. That's right. We've been working over over the last since 1990. We've had to do um, this is the second time we've been tr we've tried to do a housing element. Um, the first one was never fully certified, but it was for about 2,000 housing units. The reason it wasn't certified was because the state said, "Look, you're only providing for one kind of housing type." single family residential. You are not providing for the other kinds of housing types that, that, this, that we require at the state level. Um, so all we did here um, was to, um, was to uh, say, okay, you, okay, we hear you. We got it. So we, here's where this zoning overlay we're proposing um, to, uh, to ensure, assure you, as well as those changes to the definitions in the zoning ordinance about transitional housing and SROs so that we can really show that we've got the full range of housing types, um, including the multifamily rental covered. Uh, one just final comment, um, just for, mostly for the members of the public. Our number went up to 2,400, and that was because we were not successful in getting the last round certified. So luckily, the last round, the 2000, 1999 to 2006, was a period where we built a lot of housing. So. We had to carry over our whole entire period, a prior period where we didn't have a housing sort of uh, element, add it to our current one. So that was cumulative, but luckily we were able to subtract out all the housing we built between 1999 and, and 2006. And then at the end of the day, it only, we only ended up having to add about another 400 units to our regional housing as, um, needs assessment because of our failure to adopt a housing element the last round. We are very concerned, and that's why we're pushing so hard to get this housing element certified this round, because if we don't and we get penalized the next round and this carries over, we are going to be in serious trouble because this period, 2007 to 2014, has not been a very productive period for building housing. We've built very few units. so. A uh, one more reason why we are why we're pushing so hard, and when um, we decided, and the planning board decided, this is an absolute priority that we do our best effort to at least try to make this happen this round and before the the, the uh, statutory deadline. 